What's up guys? Just finished fasting cardio. It's Monday. We're nine weeks out. It's official nine weeks. And I'll tell you what, I mean last week my check in 164 point 164 point eight, I believe my weigh-in was. So wasn't terrible, it's progress, but I'll tell you what, like right now I'm mad as hell. You know, I just had a talk with my coach yesterday, and for being nine weeks out, he said I'm behind. So I mean, 22 weeks is how long my prep is. So I've been at it now for now nine weeks out. So Rub that math is real quick, but 13 weeks. For 13 weeks, I've dedicated every meal, every ounce of fiber of my being to training, to not sleeping, to waking up, going to the gym, making my food, meal prepping. And for him to tell me that I'm not, not I'm, I'm behind for being nine weeks out, honestly, fuck that. I'm not, I could just like, buckle down and say, oh, I'm not going to do it, I'm not going to be ready, but you know, I didn't make every sacrifice, every meal, every time I didn't go out with people, every dinner that I missed, everything that I'm not eating, every black coffee that I drank, every just meal with just chicken and broccoli, for every fucking meal that I put forward, I'm not going to be behind, being ready is not an excuse and it's not an option, these next nine weeks, we're about to kick it up, we're going to go after it, whatever your goals are, fucking chase them down and murder them, don't let lack of effort or not being ready be the reason why you don't shine. Fuck that, it's go time. Nine weeks, let's kill it. See, I just need privacy. Plus a whole lot of tree, fuck all this modesty. I just need space to do me, get away with what they're trying to see. A Stella Maxwell right beside of me. A Ferrari, I'm buying three. So in the last clip you saw, that was from Monday. Today is now Friday. This is the last day of the week. So yeah, Monday I really just got, you know, you get told that you're not gonna be ready, you're nowhere, you're nowhere near ready where you should be. Then you, you know, it gets you thinking. So I really buckled down this week. Just try to crush every work with that I had, which I did. Really loud bus. So, and then I weighed in today. So I waited on Friday because I'm going on an adventure tomorrow, which you guys are going to be on board with. But weighed in at 159.9, no, 159.8. So goodbye to the 160s finally. So it's a solid two pounds loss. If I keep going at this rate, I'm going to be just ready by stage day. So it's all about every week stepping it up because it's going to get harder to lose the weight. And that's just the way it goes. But either way, what you see here is the first of many. Hold on. One more people picky with their prices. Either way, what you see here it's the first of many post 5 p.m. coffees. Probably my seventh coffee today. Not from Dunkin's, because I'm not a millionaire. But, first post 5, because we got a long night ahead of us. I'll show you guys in a little bit. But for now, got to pick up the tools that I need, which somewhat have to do with food. So I'll check with you guys in a bit. Six pack bag. We stocked and ready. We're ready for the road. Look at that. We ready. There's actually four meals inside that one cubby. Two more meals over there. 102 to 306. Let's let the fun begin. Is that what it is? Yes, it's a Columbus Convention Center. Okay, it's only going to take 11 hours. Jesus, God! Oh my God. First stop of many. Do you want anything? Uh, there you go. What do yes. you want? Yes, caramel, iced coffee, cream, no sugar. Damn. As long as there's no sugar. What's that? Welcome to Dunkin'. How can I help you? Yeah, I'm going to get two iced coffees. Can I get one medium iced caramel with cream, no sugar? Medium iced coffee, cream, caramel, no sugar. Alright, anything else? Yeah, and then uh, second large iced coffee. This is a large? Yep. Okay. Can I get that dark roast, black with seven Splendors, and a shot of turbo? Okay, well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, large iced coffee, dark roast, black with a shot of turbo? Yep. Yeah? French vanilla. Oh, French vanilla, okay. Seven Splendors. Seven Splendors. Yep, and that's okay. all. Okay, anything else? That'll be it. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> you had one job, lady. <laughs> you had one job. Here you go. I got two. Um, one for the blood and one for the load. I got two. Um, one for the beaches and one for the toes. I got these two. Oh. Lamp up and I'm ring, ring, ring. Skip stepping. Jump in the fire. Hit the juice. I'm 
my ride. I got front and back and side to side. Then I let the Alpine play. Hey, the new shit by NWA. It was gangster, gangster at the top of the list. Bathroom break at, let's see, what time is it right now? It's about 2 in the morning. Yo, this gas station looks like an amusement park. I don't know what's going on. But, still awake, still driving, still grinding. Let's get it. Alright, what do we got here? Huh. It's not even focusing. It's almost nine. We need coffee. Coffee. Need coffee? Coffee. Coffee. We need coffee. And there's no dockings for like 20 miles. So, we know you GPS. Press to County Road 18. No. Then take ramp ahead. No. I need my coffee. So, we're going to go to Panera. Panera like bread. Panera. Just another day of Panera bread. Dress Take shoes and shots. Let's go. We help. On the Panera. And this one has a drive through Damn. Look at my Panera's don't have drive throughs But off to get like four cups of coffee and then back on the road. Let's do it. This place got everything though. There's a Chipotle. Let's see. A Chipotle over there. There's a Dairy Queen Grill and Chill. There's a giant ass Walmart. Okay, Ohio. Okay. At least we didn't have to park and eat. Okay, we're in the parking garage. And it is packed, man. But there's still like everybody's like just getting here. And this started hours ago. So it should be a good time. Yeah, it was still what time is it now? It's like 11. It's so started at 9. But still, you know, if it was me and I lived in Ohio, I would have been the first one in the door. And if I wasn't two hours late, I would have been like second in the door. But we're not going to get into reasons why we were late now, are we? It is not my fault. Okay. You, you so, anyways. Stop every five minutes. On our way inside now, checking with you guys when we get in there. It's going to be crazy. I said it's going to be awesome. I've never been in there. I'm just hyped because, hey, it's all fitness people and I'm a fitness head. Let's do it. Let's take the stairs. Narrowest escalators of all time. What the hell is this? We're okay. It's not easy to navigate. We'll find a way. We'll find a way. Go, 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 go. Look at this view. Look at this scenic awesomeness. Of just. You can't even tell from the camera. It just looks like. It's, it's kind of. Yeah, yeah, get out of here. I don't even ever video. Okay. It's like a Hummer. Mad Hummers. And me. Alright, we've now started to find our way to. There's a crowd of people and events going on. We just passed. Oh, airbrush tanning. I should have got that done. Should have. But I'll have mine soon enough. Yeah, now I have to go find where to check in. Oh, damn. There's just millions. Of people. Yeah, I'm about to go get lost in this crowd. Let's do it. Let's go. I remember all the people how they said I wouldn't make it. I just wanna show you that I'm here and I'ma take it. Recently I feel like I've been having revelations. All I need is all and I'm good. Such a trip now, cause I'm taking trips now. Inches from some luggage bags with custom made grips now. All because I ripped down stages with my gift now. I'm standing on the cliff where I can say goodbye to it. Now I remember all the people how they said I wouldn't make it. I just wanna show you that I'm here and I'ma take it. Recently I feel like I've been having revelations. All I need is God and I'm good. And I just wanna show you how I come. Aroma. And if you're in the days, then I can help you out 
out your coma No diploma, but the art I spew belongs inside the MoMA I'm trying to make my mind flat That's my persona, and your guns could go pow pow But I still love the corner So shout us out to everybody feeling like a goner They put us in this ocean with emotionless piranhas I swim around the ocean trying to feel like I belong here But something tells me I will hit Expo Everybody hits the escalator, look at that Alright, so I'm pretty much rushed from the convention. I didn't walk in as much as I want to because I couldn't move my arms. It was packed in there. But it's alright, it was definitely a good time. Had some fun, met some cool people, which was awesome. Had this thing. <laughs> but no, definitely awesome. Definitely gonna try to come back next year. And hopefully I'll get to figure out if I'm to come tomorrow morning. But gonna try to make it to the gym tonight. So if I do that, I'm gonna see how much that I can get on. So let's film and see if I can meet anybody there. I didn't support us, so we're not giving it a go up here. So I'll check with you guys in a few. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next clip. Morning, fam. So did end up going to the gym last night because by the time we got back, it was seven like ten, seven ten. Like 7.10 and then I looked it up and it closed at 8 and it was 15 minutes away so at that point there was no point. So woke up at around 6.30, went to the gym, did my fasted cardio. Going to go to the gym now, it opens at 8 o'clock and it's about 7.56, 7.54, the clock 6 minutes fast. And yeah, I guess we can get a workout in now so that we can make the 13 hour drive back. Yes. It's going to suck. But at the same time, you know, I had fun, had a great weekend, trying to finish it off with an awesome arm workout at Powerhouse Gym that I've definitely always wanted to go to. So, looking forward to doing that. And yeah, I'm um, what's the? Hi. Where are you going? Really? It's a one way. Oh, that's a one way. And you're still on there. So there we go. So I'm learning how to drive in Ohio with these roads that are kind of backwards looking. Which he's not working out for. But, uh, but it's all right. It so looks pretty though. Yeah, it looks nice. Let's we'll take a picture on that bridge. Right, I'll see you guys in a few. Found it. Powerhouse gym. Yeah. Almost, almost missed it. Look at that. Like, like, blends right in like a sophisticated building. So, 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 so. so we're out here at Powerhouse Fitness. That's all right. Well, Rob Bailey, Amy Bailey, Mike, we got the whole crew here. Everybody's behind me. Doing their own thing. Pretty fucking sick. Falling over the neck of my arms. It makes no sense to my legs. But, either way, truck, three more sets of arms. Venture down. Fucking. Not even that heavy. Once it's there, we're going to accept. Bench, curl, hammer curl, done. Good.